going down now into the left and right at Brunswick and Nelson. Oh, 
down into Riches once again. A little bit of smoke from Jonathan Bailey's as he lifts off uh, for Riches, just slightly concerning. So, uh, something which uh, happened this morning as well, but it hasn't been a Dutch touring car Capri, driven uh, today by another man who does a lot of rallying as well as racing, that's James Slaughter. James Slaughter racing in the Frank Jean car, which uh, was uh, campaigned in the Dutch touring car championship. <laughs> Yes. I'm not sure what you can see from where you are, but uh, I'm just actually chatting with Carl Jones there, who's actually going to do the second race uh, uh, in the Henry Mann um, Sport. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that's just, it's really worth watching. I know the cars over front are great, but the, this battle's all the way down the, down the path. So, uh, Get the chance, here he comes now, coming through the current record, but drifts it through. Harry really gets, he's got the grips, it. we've got to grips with that BMW. Yeah, indeed, and I was saying in qualifying, it's a shame we don't see more of the BMWs out now. They used to be very popular in the other two litre touring cars, uh, with uh, Jackie Oliver, I mentioned, driving uh, in a, uh, driving in, uh, one of them, but uh, this is the Battle 4, side by side, going to the Henry Mann goes around the outside, he's got the position, tries to turn in, and Harry Barton says, no, you don't, I'm still here. So uh, Henry has to rethink that one, but he goes around the outside going up towards Wilson, and it looks like he's going to be And yes, it is indeed, as they come through Chapman, it's the red and gold, Alan Mann colours that leads the white BMW. On its own, there'll be uh, the, the, a race within a race, if you like, for the U2TC section, and it's Henry Mann that now leads from Harry Barton in the Tony Drop Trophy race. That leads the James Slaughter to Crick, and the Robert Oldshaw Road has been having a brilliant battle with the, uh, the big hole from Commodore for the whole race, but the Commodore actually has pulled away a little bit now. Here comes James Slaughter to cross the timing line in the Frank and Jean Dutch Touring Car Capri, left-hand drive, as you can see, into the right-hander at Riches. Uh, some way off the now by Jonathan Bailey, Rick Wood having dropped I take the change the turbo with the actuator, now they're going to put the old actuator back on the new turbo. Well, that's what I'm guessing they're doing anyway. But the Browning needs to go. Well, the boost pressure is there, so that can take it over for the second race. Back to you.